Well, Mirror Merchants has been a fabulous experience for all of us. It has given us a platform not just to act but also to express ourselves. Um, over this whole year, we've not only become very close friends, we're like a family. Arnish always tells us, um, do something new, bring in something different to the table. Don't be yourselves. I don't want you all to act yourselves. And because of that, we've not just played different characters. We've also gone a step ahead to try different accents, uh, adopt different personalities, do something completely out of what we thought we could do. And that has sort of given us a confidence to go out there um, and yeah, that's taken away all the stage fright that you could ever have. You know, people usually ask, oh, don't you have stage fright? Don't you get scared when you're right out there on stage? And I say, no, we're just so prepared. We have so many rehearsal sessions. We have improv. And it's, it kind of gives us the confidence to go out there and think, I got this. When I say we do different things, you'll understand because if you, can't, you, if you came for Asylum, you will know that our characters in Murgistan are so different from what we were in Asylum. Asylum was a very long process actually. When we came in, we had no idea what we were getting into. <laughs> Which is actually a good thing because we started off with research and um, we were doing research based on current activities, um, political events, uh, the disorders that each of us had because uh, it was a play about ju uh, juvenile delinquents with psychological disorders. There was massive amount of research, of, uh, research available for us and um, after that we, ha we had to base our characters on that, we had to write our own backstory so there was a lot that went into the process and um, the result was what you saw at Asylum. Hopefully you come again. Uh, please come watch us from Kurdistan. Yay!